Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to see how we can install VMware Workstation in our system. In this video, I would like to talk about installing VMware Workstation. So this is a hypervisor product from VMware and there was a free try available from their website. So here is a VMware website www.vmware.com in a product you can select a VMware workstation. So this is a pro version of VMware. So here we need to find the VMware for our operating system. I have a uh, Windows operating system so I am download VMware workstation 14 pro for the Windows. Just download it. Okay. I have already these download versions in my download folder. Now double click on it and start installing. Before you start installing VMware Workstation, VMware Workstation will not install on a machine if you already have a running Hyper-V. So you need first to uninstall the Hyper-V and then install VMware where it could be a conflict with other hypervisor. Also, when you kick off the VMware installation wizard, it should tell you about any potential conflict. So, I have already removed a Hyper-V from my system. So, press yes. So, it start installing VMware Workstation Pro. So window installer preparing to install. So here is our installation wizard. It's a welcome to the VMware Workstation Pro setup wizard. Click on the next and read these all license agreement and click on the radio button. I accept the terms, the license agreement. Click on this checkbox and click on the next now it's uh, asking me for the location i want to install the vmware workstation i make it as it is it's so enhance a keyboard driver a report will be required to use this feature this feature required 10 mb on your hard host drive i am put it as it is and click on the next now check for product update on a startup if we want to check our vmware workstation on our startup we can Click on the checkbox. I just remove it. Join the VMware Custom Experience Improvement Program. I am also remove the checkbox and click on the next. Now create a shortcut from VMware Workstation Pro in the following place. I put it both because I need a shortcut on my desktop as well as on a start menu program. Click next. So we are ready to install. Click on the install. So it start installing my VMware Workstation Pro in a system. So here we done complete the VMware Workstation Pro setup. If you have a license key, then go ahead and type the key. If you don't have, just finish it. So I'm using the VMware Workstation as my trial version. So for the confirmation, I'm just open this VMware Workstation Pro. So now it's asked for a license key or the option to run as a trial basis. I need to enter a valid email address. If I'm selecting this and press continue, it's give me a option that a user account control I'm clicking on yes and thank you for evaluating VMware Workstation Pro. VMware Workstation 14 is the most advanced virtualization software. There are giving a greetings. Now click on the finish. So we did it. Our VMware Workstation is installed successfully. We have a 30 days of trial version for use this VMware Workstation. After that you can purchase it. So if you have a license key, you can enter a license key over here or you can use a free for a 30 days. 
so these are the installation of VMware Workstation Player so these are the install of VMware Workstation Pro so thank you for watching